Hey, welcome to a new Project Camp update. So we bought this big piece of land and are prototyping a more sustainable way of living. I'm not sure how it's going to go, but let's see. And in the previous video you could see us setting up a lot of basic infrastructure, like water and electricity. But one of the main things we never really made was a toilet. So up until now it's mainly been like this, in the bushes, uh, without the pants. Uh, so yeah, kind of basic. So in this video we're going to make a compost toilet. And we also have the first person helping for a longer period of time, uh, Ian from the US, to actually help to build this toilet. And on top of that we're also going to use some recycled plastic. So, uh, so this is where we're going to make room for our, our first outhouse. It's, uh, it's about 100 centimeters wide, so something like this. Um, and we want to start at, it's going to sit about here and go into the forest more, but while we're at it we might as well so take care of all of this. Hmm. Today I'm going to be leveling out the area that we cleared earlier. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect because we're likely laying down some gravel um, to separate the the platform from the soil, but it's pretty aggressively sloped right now, so we have to do something about that. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Let's get started. Just unloaded all of the lumber into our stockpiles here. Um, let's go on a journey to see how well cut these are. Bam! Next is squaring. Here it was on to checking our cuts and building our frames and I had a lot of really good help from Alex. As you can see we've finished building out the framing except for the door that we'll do when we assemble and uh, the next step is to oil to make sure that our wood does not rot. Poor little grasshopper, look at him. Look at cute. Mm. I recommend you you bounce somewhere else, dude. There we go. Now that the bottom of our platform is well oiled, we're going to move all of our frame pieces to the end destination of our outhouse and start assembling.
So now we cut our siding stock down to sides. And we're going to install it. Next was assembling the roof and I had another wonderful little helper for this part. In the meanwhile, Dave constructed a toilet seat box, uh, cutting a hole using measurements made off of the toilet seat and with a raised floor to bring the poop bucket close enough to the hole that there could be no room for any messy splashes. Yo. So for the toilet seat, we wanted to try something experimental. So we looked on a precious plastic map and reached out to Studio Smelt from Amsterdam. And they are gonna make the seats from recycled plastic.
that, that. Oh man, I don't even want to get the knife near it. I'm scared I'll nick it. Look at that pattern. So you don't see the poo dirt in it? I don't know that we're going to be allowed to poop around this. It's so nice. Oh dang! They went! They went all out! Whew, we have our selection! I guess we did say we're going to make two eventually. <laughs> I told him to make two. Look at that. I feel like we're going to be spoiled. Bye. So now, as you can see, we finished our composting toilet. Let's take a tour. We've got our bucket of sawdust that we uh, bought from a local lumber mill. Uh, really, really cheap. It's perfect biomass for maintaining the moisture levels that we're going to need, and also for keeping down the smell once things, you know, go down. Uh, we have our toilet paper, of course. And we have our really beautiful toilet seats made from pressed plastic, from a precious plastic workspace out in Amsterdam. Um, this beautiful white speckled with colors and a nice out contrast out black garbage white speckling. And uh, to demonstrate, you know, we would sit down and do our business. After you're done, you take a scoop put it down the, the bin. Because this is our first, uh, we're gonna do a little bit extra just to make sure that the base has a nice layer of sawdust before anyone poops. Cool. Now let's go out back and see how the, the exchange process works. We have a very handy hatch right here. After everyone's done their business and it gets full enough, we take it out, have everything inside, bring this to our composting location, um, add it to the, the pile that would be the active one where we're putting all of our current processed or currently uh, added poop and pee um, next to a, a composting pile one that will sit for six months or a year um, just to make sure that all pathogens are killed it's safe to use um, our hatch is really well built it has a nice stops built in so it's very easy to uh, orient it right under the toilet seat yeah so we have a composting toilet now we um, it's quite an upgrade from having to find places around the property uh, make sure you don't step in somebody else's poop. Uh, and with that, uh, I have some business of my own to attend to. We're gonna do the first poo. Yes, right now. All right, so that was it. Big upgrade actually, it was super nice to have this. Uh, we're not really sure yet what to do with all the resources we create, still figuring out and what is the best system for that. So we'll see more about that later. Uh, for now, thanks a lot for watching. If you like what we do, make sure to visit support.projectcomp.com. I'll see you in the next video. Instruction manuals. <laughs>